Hi. I have too many friends to stay in touch by phone, so I use a lot of social networking sites instead. Today, I'm finding out how people feel about modern communication. How do you like to stay in touch with your friends? The main way that I keep in contact with my friends is via email, um, and I also use mobile phone. I like face-to-face -face contacts best, um, so that's always my preference. But otherwise, um, I speak on the phone, um, write letters, send emails. I think it's really important to stay in touch with friends. So uh, I've got a really close group of friends that we have dinner once a month. We do a kind of round robin, you know, we each t take turns to cook for each other. So we do that regularly. I keep in contact with my friends via email. Well, I used to use an awful lot of postcards and letters, but of course that's now email. Email, I still write letters, <laughs> um, send text messages and phone calls. Uh, my phone. My phone is my lifeline. use it for everything. I hate computers. Has modern technology helped us to communicate better? No. I think we think we can communicate better, but I think it just masks our uh, fear of um, communicating in an honest and open way. We're able to make contact with someone via mobile phone instantaneously. It's given us more options. Um, I'm a bit of a technophobe, though. Um, I don't use social networking sites. Uh, I haven't got on the whole kind of Twitter bandwagon. Um, so I know that that's there for me to use if I wanted to, but I tend not to bother. In theory, it should be better, but in practice, sometimes you just have to speak to somebody on the phone. It's hard if it comes to just um, communication, like remote communication. It has helped greatly. But on the flip side, I think it hasn't because it's reduced a lot of physical contact, face-to-face -face contact. And I think a lot of people still feel isolated even though we communicate a lot more than ever before? No, I think it's probably made it a lot worse as people don't talk face to face as much and they just rely on text speak and things and points don't get put across as well if you're not speaking face to face. What kinds of problems can modern communication cause? I think modern communication can cause a lot of different problems. Um, a common one would be to email the wrong person, I think. I've done that a few times myself. Emails, I, I tend to, between my teachers, I always write the wrong things and don't send the right work and send all the wrong stuff to all the wrong people and get all my contact lists wrong. It's so much easier to be misunderstood, you know, if you're just writing an email, for example. When I was working, I remember sending a really important email to the chair of governors at the school where I worked, and I was typing quickly at the end, and I was signing it my name, which is Sarah, and I typed Satan by mistake <laughs> and sent it.